I will have to use the breaker bar. <laughs> no one produces this material anymore. See, kind of windy a little bit. Fire everywhere, house is burned. And we proceed to work. Total mess here, guys. It's windy. It's windy today. So guys, I'm going to put a link in the description about this mod, how to cut it, where to cut it. So guys, today I'm going to show you how I changed, how I replaced my seats, my laser, my laser seats. You see, back there it's uh, laser seats and uh, here is already two driver and the passenger velour japanese seats you see how deep is this how deep is this how deep is this velour you see even in a frozen fucking freezing cold your ass not going to be cold and you don't need any heating you don't need heat here it ain't heating here and don't need it i already replaced these two ones and hey, you say, I never seen this kind of seats. And I'm gonna tell you, especially to American fellows, this is from Japanese Explorer. You see it. It's here this and lumbar support, and it works by the way. Neomo. And uh, <laughs> when I sit here, I feel, <laughs> I feel like I'm in heaven, guys. It's really comfortable, don't need any heating. And in the summer, you don't sweat on these seats. Your ass is not sticking to the seats and your legs here underneath, feeling comfortable. Yes, it has not this, uh, it ain't got this thing that uh, like pulling out like this, but you don't need it. This seats is really long here, it's really long. It's longer than American with this uh, support here. But uh, only if you don't uh, get this support out. You see, I'm sitting here and my knees and my calves is like sticking here, like it's too long. And for guys like two meters, I mean like six feet uh, two, six feet one, it's gonna be comfortable as hell. And uh, you see, no one produces this material anymore. No one. This material is old Japanese Explorer. 1996, uh, second generation Explorer that wasn't Japanese right-handed. Like you, you see, wheel was here, steering wheel was here. But seats, 100% fits here. And I'm sitting on the passenger like a seat and here is the driver's seat and I'm gonna show you I'm gonna show you guys it has lumbar support you see it working you see you just see how it uh, works <laughs> right now and those and those and those all works all works on Japanese Explorer because Japanese guys really care for them cars, so it's 100% uh, working. One thing I needed to do, I replaced Japanese. I'm gonna see, this is American, this is from American seats, because my belts, you see this like, like this, they like that. But uh, originally there was Japanese uh, locks, I'm gonna see. And uh, this uh, not, won't fit on this uh, Japanese. I'm gonna show you how Japanese looks like. You see, I already prepared seats. And I, I took off them because they are bad for transportation. It's like interface. You see? You see them locks? Locks like this, not like this on Americans or European. Japanese looks like this, but I heard that some Americans guys uh, Ford's uh, gets like this. So maybe you guys in America got these ones.
because uh, I got an European Ford. I got European Ford for Russia. So maybe you, so maybe you won't have to do replace them. So now, I'm, guys, I'm going to take the seats out, and what I'm going to show you, I got this, uh, I got this latch, I got this hole here for the fuel pump. I'm going to show you, guys. Uh, some says, some said to me that uh, I should uh, take the metal plate and screw it, so not to get the dirt and uh, all this kind of stuff here in my saloon, in my Ford Explorer. I'm going to show you now what's happened here. What's happened there? Kind of windy today. <laughs> See, kind of windy a little bit, but we Russians not stopping. Wind won't stop the Russian. I'm going to replace them seats because the uh, first driver seat and the passenger seat I replaced in the winter and uh, had not had a little, a little time to do it with the rear ones. Now I'm going to do it. So. I got this. I got this. And now, oh, you see. Good stuff. I forgot it. And you see? Pullers for the fuel lines. I got all this here. Some uh, glass for the kid. And, uh, <laughs> you see, you see. My ledge, my hole for fuel pump. No dirt, you see, there is, you can say this is a lot of dirt, but <laughs> it ain't nothing, guys. But uh, easy access for the fuel lines, for the fuel pump. I uh, replaced the fuel pump a couple times, and it looks like a charm. You just pull it off, like a little incline here, and get out. So guys, I'm going to put a link in the description about this mod, how to cut it, where to cut it, Russian style. So, stay tuned, and I'll proceed to replace those seats. Then we'll screw this bolt, and then this nut. So like this, take it out now, so step further. Just like this. So, <laughs> you see, you see, you see, you see, guys, a lot of sand here. Wait, came from the sand. Sometime I <laughs> I transported some sand here. So I'm gonna somehow get a manage to get it out. This one kind of tough because I, I went screwed it before. So I screwed some nuts and now we do this. Oh, Anthony Burgess, Clockwork Orange in Russian. Haha, <laughs> guys, it's kind of cool. Some pair of gloves. And this is from the steering wheel. Old crap. This is for the tires, a little WD-40, always gonna help us, wait some time, I will have to use the breaker bar. <laughs> uh oh, safety is on danger on this car. <laughs> Because now it's going to be only on this nut. Because this one broke. So, taking this off. This off. Like this. Someone's there. Something's holding it. 
So, ha, total mess here, guys. I'm gonna get the dirt buster. Oh shit, it's so long for the power, but I should use some power extender. You see how I managed to 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 solve this problem. You see, guys, watch and learn from a Russian guy. <laughs> So let's get it on, guys. Oh, sand. A lot of sand, guys. So kind of, kind of like this. Better than it was before, how my old man used to say. So you see, new seat, now we're going to install it. So I gotta aim this hole, gotta get into this hole, you see? Yeah, haha, <laughs> I got it. And now, like this now I should uh, somehow get into this hole oh hey it was a um... sorry I'm hungry I ate some chocolate I should pull this and this uh, came in here so we can now I can do like this, but uh, not forget the safety. Not forgetting the belt, okay? See, there is a, not only wind, but a fire. And we, by the way, it ain't a thing for Russians. Fire everywhere, house is burned, and we proceed to work. Now should uh, uh, screw this seat down down here down here down here with these nuts rusty as hell and you see it's a little dirty here but looks uh, brand new especially here proceed to the second one it's gotta be way more easier because the it's just a little a little seat and down here well, it should be go here like this so we did here and I cover this like this you gotta get those you see like new they like new paint is not touched <coughs> Japanese Japanese are good take a little WD-40 and like uh, lubricate my nuts like this do it like this
Almost brand new. Hello. Hello, this is my son. He helps me a lot. He helps me and he helps me when he's not interfered, right? <laughs> he knows a little English. <laughs> Say something, Roma. Say something in English. Goodbye. That's it. That's enough, guys. <laughs> Oh, how this works. It's not like all American cars. How I adjust his is this. I think it's not adjustable. Hello. <laughs> Do you like the new uh, the new sofa? Roma, do you like it? I'm Roma. <laughs> I like it. He likes it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's windy. It's windy today. Yeah, this is true. It's kind of windy. And it's not adjustable. You can't pull it out. Oh. American fellas, if you know about the Japanese seats, say to me, is it adjustable? And we're going to end this video. Subscribe to my channel, press thumbs up, write the comments down below. Oh, you see my door I is almost cake. broken by this I'm wind. chocolate cake. Here's chocolate cake, okay? See ya, bye bye.